Next up, we have Plasma. Now, this is interesting. Her chest is so smooth. I thought, like, it's such a weird cut, like the weird neckline. I thought it was a shirt underneath. I didn't realize that was her skin. It is so strange. She waxes? I don't know what is, I don't know what's going on with this look. Is it bad that I don't hate it? I don't hate it either. I'm just a bit confused. I don't. To be like, honest, I think it this gives is goth. goth. Yeah, this is goth, but there's just so many different components, like the shirt with the shrug, and then there's a belt, the choker. I think the long or the deep, deep neck combined with a choker makes me not like it as much. I think it's just something about that neckline is just. Well, you know what? Have, what would have fixed it for me? What? If she put like a white ascot underneath the uh, necklace, and then filling up some of that space a little bit more, making it a little more voluminous. Because if you're not gonna wear boots yes. for this runway, a nice ascot would go nicely with the little collar that's around the neck. I agree with that. Bring a little bit more of that white into the design that you have in the. Because like your hound's tooth on your like shirt is gray. It's not white. The belt is the only. The belt and the streamers only are. Only, bleh, 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 bleh. The belt, the streamers, and the top of the collar are the only white on this look. And the nails. Yeah, this is very... Uh, she even did some notches makeup. in her eyebrow, like, to look like bones. Yeah, that's interesting. They're saying that she looks like plasma. Yeah, in, she's in, plasma. In the face. Yeah, they were like, you look like plasma on your face, and then your outfit, I don't know what's going on. Like, I feel like her makeup is even a bit different than usual. So, I don't even know if she looks like herself here. I think she just tried to do something different. And like I was saying earlier, I really applaud her for doing that. Going out of her comfort zone. I think that's way more interesting than just doing what you always do. I and think... I don't know. I don't, I don't like the neckline, but if that were fixed, I wouldn't have not liked it. I think I'm going to send this one back, though. For me, it's goth. Like, it's... It is goth. And if, if the category is not, like, traditional goth, and it's specifically nouveau goth or neo goth specifically mm -hmm. do you, i don't feel like a morticia adams gown is neo goth it's beautiful but if we want to think neo goth i definitely in my idea would think of something like what plasma made here yeah i agree with that probably but maybe they didn't maybe mm -hmm. they weren't told specifically that it's neo goth i could have just been told that it's like well they, they rupaul goth. said it at the beginning when she was announcing the challenge no i mean like when they find out about the challenges don't they get like a list of things and sometimes they made these looks always... here oh right what am i talking about <laughs> these looks were made in house girl completely forgot okay whatever <laughs> Yeah, so people don't know what Neo Goth is, not even myself. <laughs> so I think this is definitely, out of most of the things we saw, this is very, I think this is very close to what Neo Goth is supposed to be. Yeah, it feels like it's the idea of Goth, like, brought with this sort of, I don't know, it's, it's the most creative looking Goth we have here. Yeah. The pants are see-through and textured, like it, it like ribbed for his pleasure. The double belt is like so like, none of the other queens are accessorizing. Okay, goth is also like so not in quotation marks high fashion runway. <laughs> so like this very pe pedestrian look is very goth because I would see a goth person wear something like this. Mm -hmm. You know, I think because it's so, it seems to fit the category so well, I'm just not going to send it back. I'm going to leave it on my plate. Yeah. I think it's, the idea was there. It's just, just a couple small things. I a little like. bit of editing. Yeah. But even then, I don't think it'd save her because RuPaul clearly did not like this at all. No, she hated this. I don't know why. She doesn't, she didn't like it. And I know Bob the Drag Queen has a telephone in and said, well, you're wearing my fabric, so now we have to fight. Hmm. that's gonna be the new diss track watch it come out do we are we done with her mm -hmm. yeah I'm, I'm leaving it on my plate i just realized i didn't read i'm leaving it on my plate but i do appreciate the concept and i do appreciate how hard she played with it yeah me too